Good evening, welcome to the Barrel House. I am uh, at my buddy Taz's house to try some wonderful whiskeys. You can kind of see his stuff in the background. He's got some good stuff. And um, you may recognize Taz from a short we did at the whiskey. So he's kind of famous. And uh, we're gonna start, we're doing some, Taz got some fun high-end stuff. So we're gonna do something really cool today. And we are gonna start with Booker's 2021 number two. So as you can see, these are pretty cool. Here's the back end of the box. We'll leave that right there for a second. And uh, yeah, we got Booker's number two. Um, here we go, 2021. Let's listen to that bad boy, Taz, here we go. Oh, baby, All that's right. a good sound. Not bad. So we're gonna do a just a half pour, because these things are, uh, yeah, it's a little, um, a little bit of alcohol in these. We're gonna get some jet fuel going. Okay, so I'm gonna put this back right here. Move the bottle right there. Get my glass there. Um, so I gotta put my glasses on real quick. This uh, this batch is 2021 number two. It's um, 127.9 proof. Oh my goodness! Let it breathe. Let it breathe. Six years and five months. Um, the Bookers, if you didn't know, they have a rack house, and so these will show a percentage. I'm not going to try to read through all that of where they're racked, like high, low, and move around. They'll get a barrel that's in one spot and down to get you know different heights and humidity and sun and whatever to age it. So six years and five months on this one. And uh, cheers, cheers. Let's give it. A, I'm going to give mine a smell. What do you think you're smelling there? Deliciousness. Yeah, that's got a really sweet smell. Vanilla for sure. Yep. Wow, that is that's pretty smooth for 127 proof. Now it's it's definitely gonna burn a little, of course. <coughs> because, and we got some water if we need to add any water there, Taz. <coughs> yeah, might, that's that. You might need some water. <laughs> need some water? Just a little, not much. Very smooth though for 127. For, well, 127.9. So we're basically talking 128 proof whiskey. Um, this is this is good stuff. So we are doing bookers today mainly, and then we have a surprise rye because you know I like to be called the rye guy. So we have a surprise fun rye. So we have four whiskeys today. So please uh, stay tuned and watch for a little bit. We'll get through this one as quick as we can, but because they're so hot. And so delicious, I don't want to just slam it. So um, we will finish this up. <coughs> ah, it's got a, boy, I just love the smell. <coughs> nice sweet vanilla. Oh, that's good though. That is a great, the second drink is uh, just like butter. Yeah, no, super smooth. I, once again, I'm gonna say that I can't, uh, believe that this is that high proofed i didn't even need water now i have ice cubes but i just poured it right in there and, and went so um excellent excellent stuff we're going to cap this one up and we're going to put it in its box and as you see here it clicks right in it has a nice clicker and then you put its card in there and you put this thing right back on there and uh, pretty awesome. All right, so now we are going to, that's off camera, uh, the switch glasses, and I'm gonna do a little bit more ice. Any ice or test? No, nope, I'm good. Okay, three drops. All right, now we're going on. Oh. Oh yeah, we did that one. I put it in upside. Well, hold on, I put that one in upside down. Jeez. There we go. Let me fix that. Okay, now we're on to Booker's number three. So as you can see, twenty twenty one. One is very hard to find. So he's got he's got two, three, and four, which is amazing that you can get those. Um, he also does own a little book, but we're not, that's not going to come out today. But so this is twenty twenty one. 
number three. Click that out of there. So number three, um, I will read real quick on the, it is 125.5 proof. So it's a baby compared to what we just had. Also six years and five months. So it's a beautiful bottle once again. Um, I've never had Booker's before, so I was really excited to try this. And I don't own a bottle of Booker's, but I might own a bottle of Booker's tomorrow after what I just had. And then, all right, that sounds good too. So let's use a new shot glass. Really nice shot glasses too, boy. Heavy duty. Only the best for Barrel House. There we go. I like it. Is that enough? That's perfect. Okay. So, cheers on this one. Nice, rich, dark. Yeah, it, it seems to have a little bit deeper color, doesn't it? Oh, that's um, a little different smell. That's got a spicier yeah, smell to it. Yeah, it's got a little it. spicy kick to it that yep. you can kind of... Think it's a, it's got a different yeah different, it's got a it's different got a aroma to different it. aroma so it smells like good Booker though okay here we go oh wow that's a completely different flavor now that's there's no vanilla there at all that's um kind of wow caramely and spicy I'm, yeah, I wonder what the caramel spice I'm see what the rye notes are if it shows the breakdown here yeah that's totally. That's um, different. I mean, in, in a great way. It's just another great, very smooth for 125. Yeah, it and doesn't a half. give the grain breakdown, but I'd have to, uh, I'd have to, I'd be curious because that has definitely got more, um, more rye and uh, barley, don't you think, than the first one? Yeah, it's one? got a li little more kick, but it's very smooth too. Yeah, it's, there's not as much corn in this one, I, I think. So. But very, very even keel. And it doesn't, very smooth. it honestly doesn't seem to, I'm not getting as much heat down no, there. No, no. The, uh, the, I mean, the first one on that one was a little warmer. This has some spice notes, but it didn't have the heat, the heat burn. Boy, it comes out real smooth right away. So, yeah, this isn't, <clears throat> this isn't bad at all. So, awesome. Yeah, it doesn't, it doesn't suck. You know, and I can't sit and try to say, oh, which one's better. They're they're both fantastic. They're different. This is definitely way spicier. I mean, it's got a lot more. Um, but it, but it's very smooth still. Real smooth, but spicier with some caramel. Yeah. And I, wouldn't, I wouldn't call it uh, near as it's, it's sweet not as the first one. Yeah, um, but it's. The other one was a lot. You could taste, tell, taste the vanilla right away. But, um, very rich, very smooth, very well balanced together. All the flavors work. All right, I finished mine. Holy cow, is that good. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. So now we are going on. We'll put that one away. You see how that clicks in there? How you doing? Now we'll wrap that up in a little bit. So um, get. Oops, I'm gonna get breaks. a little bit, a little more ice. We've got an audience today. We got Ozzy's here, and Kaz has his dogs with him um or, well this is his house so of course they're with him <laughs> okay so now we are going to go on to number four which i'm excited about because it's the only one i can find that i could actually get it for in 2022 i don't 2021s are gone but i uh have means to get a number four i wanted to try these first before i spent the money and uh, i think that's going to be an easy yeah easy money spent uh, well, it's going to be hard money spent, but I'm going to spend it anyways. So here we go. Let's move this. We'll just leave that right there. All right. We're popping the cork. Oh, sounded all right. Not quite as much pop as the other ones. Okay, here we go. I think that's going to be enough for me. That's funny. There we go for Perfect. Taz. <coughs> that bad boy back up looks fairly close to the same color so number four is 124.4 proof so we're kind of went we started up and are going down this one's aged six years and six months and um yeah so it, it it's got different it, it says all the it's kind of cool it comes with this you can see here let me uh it comes with this cool card talks about the master distiller notes 
it says the batch story and everything. So um, here we go. Let's uh, give this a try. So cheers. Oh, that's uh, that's got a sweeter smell to it for sure. Yeah, that's sweet. Yeah, that is. It's that's got a nice brown sugar. Yeah, yeah, sweetness. definitely a brown sugar and just a little burn. Yeah. Yeah, but um, not not bad. No, it's not that no no spice compared to what number three was at all. It's not even. A little bit, I guess. I am I am getting a little bit of spice. There's a little bit. Second, it's a little little. Second hand. It's got a little heat, but it's not terrible. But all three of them, you get that heat. But the first one stayed a little longer. But they they uh boy they they're really good flavor. They're like slur, swear or. A little bit of heat and then then smooths right out again yeah it's, got a nice finish so it's for as hot as these things are uh proof wise they're they're incredibly smooth um very well done yeah it doesn't suck no they don't uh they don't suck i'm gonna i'm not gonna have to like spend the night i think he's sleeping on the couch okay so now we have our surprise. Um, we have done the three bookers <coughs> and all high-end stuff. Uh, I think Taz, would you say you pay between ninety-nine and one hundred nine for these? Yeah, they're a hundred-dollar retail model. Yeah, you're gonna pay uh, if you can get a good deal. A hundred's a good deal. Um, up to one twenty is the most I've really seen. But uh, you got to get them when they come out. So this video right now, the twenty two just came out. And you gotta get one now or they'll be they'll be really hard to get. So okay, we got one more that you wanna Yeah. I, I, I can use the same glass, it doesn't matter. Just dump I'll just rinse it out. Um so now our surprise, and I'm pretty stoked about this because I've never had it. We have restoration rye. And this is from uh Castle and Key. It's their single barrel um Released 2021, and uh, it is, oh, I'm trying to find. 63% rye, rye, 17 yeah. corn. And then 20% malt barley, and it is, um, where's my proof? 115 proof, so we're going high society today. Um, very hard bottle to find. It's I've never seen it on the shelf except for last year, and I was able to purchase some of the locals, local great liquor store, Red Barn in Johnstown. And fantastic I, people. I have a single barrel Castle and Key at home, just a regular old Castle and Key that's also hard to find, <coughs> but I have one. But um, and I haven't tried it yet, so I'm very uh, very curious to uh, try this one. So here we go. This is the last one. I'm going to have a full pour and just sip it. Half pour? Just a little. Yeah. Quarter pour. I got, I got all the rest of the afternoon to sit okay. in my chair. So, this is obviously going to have some probably sweet notes, maybe some spice with the rye, as much rye as there is in it with 63% rye. Um, and, 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 not a lot of corn so uh what is it 83 percent grains and 17 percent corn so we'll see that there and i hope you're enjoying the stuff he's got back here this 12 is great i just found this single barrel for myself and and it's hard to find in colorado john so, bowman yeah john bowman single barrel so let's take my glasses off again cheers did you give it a yeah it smells like great bourbon yeah, that's got a really nice, sweet smell to it. Actually, smells a little hot. So we'll, uh... it's it's smooth. It's got a warmth at the beginning, but it's not overpowering. It's not like it's gonna. It's got just a small Kentucky hug going on. Yeah, but it's smooth. It's not. It's not gonna bite your head off and burn all the way down. Yeah, it it. it... <laughs> I don't know why. I, I've never had one, but I don't know why I thought this. You know, um, I don't have all the, uh, I'm not all the smelling schools and that kind of stuff, you know, but I, this is crazy. I don't know why, but this is like a hot, uh, if you could buy a hot tamale caramel. Yeah. Think? 
It's got some. It's got a little yeah. spice. It's got some spice in it because it's so a rye, almost like a candied hot tamale with. But it's a mellow. It's something. a mellow heat. It's very smooth, blended with sweet. Yeah. So what's called a hot tamale with like caramel in the middle? <laughs> That's it. Yeah. It 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 starts super smooth. Then there's a the burn gets to here and it's done. And then it just yeah, it's just a nice right off just a chest. nice warmth. Very mm. very. Came highly recommended on their allocation shelf. Yeah, I, I bought it last year and this I forgot I had it and John and I decided that we better treat him to that because I forgot I had it there and it's amazing. All four oh. amazing, just smooth, yeah. rich pours. That I are, mean, we just had four whiskeys where the smallest one, or bourbons, uh, a little both, um, are 115.6, I believe. <clears throat> Was that one? Or was that or this one the front? One fifteen six is the yeah, lowest that's proof. That's the lowest proof that we just drank. And they're all and very they're, easy and drinking, they're, but they're rich. Yeah, and they all they all drink like lower proof than that. They're not. Um, he didn't need water. Like I said, I just put mine on ice because I, as you know, on my channel, I I don't like warm whiskey. So call me crazy, but uh, all right. So we're gonna do a quick review and uh, let's try real quick. What was your favorite one? Hmm. <coughs> it's a I don't know that I can pick a favorite because they all are unique in their own way. They are. I um they're they're all I love it because they're all easy drinking. They're just smooth and rich. I love the caramels in it, the sweetness, a little bit of heat. The hottest one was the 202102, the yeah. first one we had, yeah. which is you know, it's 129 proof or whatever. It's very little bite at the beginning, but everything mellows yeah. out. Yeah. Um, they're all, but they all have some of the similar flavors of caramel and sweet notes. Vanilla, brown sugar. Vanilla, yeah. I um, like number three just because <coughs> I like rice and I like some spice. And that mm -hmm. one was super smooth with some really nice spice, but yet it just had a candy to it. Um, they're all great. Yeah, and then, I, of course, yeah. this one is really good. Um, for a rye, maybe for me, slightly hot. Um, but, yeah, it doesn't mean you can't add water. And I'm sure as it's sitting here, it's opening up. So uh, yeah, that change. was the other thing is we pretty much poured and went and just popped the bottle. So, yeah, we, these are these have not been... Yeah, we literally pulled the We pulled the corks. These are all minutes. brand new bottles that I had from last year. They, are, they have not yeah. been opened and aired out. This is just we straight those out. We corks brand new right out of the bottle. Yep. And I was drinking my neat where I can observe different flavors with that. And they're all sensational. I don't know that I could pick one. If you can find a Booker's out there, 2022s are out. I don't think you'll find a 2021. 22, 22s are out. If you get lucky enough to find this, this is a really, I don't know what he paid for this. I'm not sure what they, what I, they run. Uh, I think it was probably a... Uh, $75 bottle if I remember yeah. right, but very it's, well worth it. It's it wasn't really good, overpriced. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be honest. I, I like it. I've got some other rides I like better. I would honestly um, I don't, I'm trying to find I don't see a rye right here by me um, The Knob Creek rye which is a lot less expensive is, is really really good and I guess for this price I don't know. I don't know if I'd pay that much for this. What do you think? It's solid enough that I wouldn't pay any more than I paid for it. Right. It was very, it was, yeah. I didn't overpay for it. Now, the Booker's $100, and I'm like, I don't usually ever spend that much. Worth every penny. Those yeah, are absolutely every, every penny. Those amazing whiskeys, amazing. and I will be going to get one. And uh, as and, you can and, see, I like my Blantons. I got my Blantons hat and on. Thanks right? to my boy John here, I picked up um, two and three. Two and four the other day of 2022, and he picked me up another. And I found the three, and I was three. hesitant to get it for myself, but they still have four. So I will, and I really like the four of this year. Now, of course, uh, the 2022s are going to be different than these. Uh, they're exactly. Gonna probably taste a little different. So I will probably go get the four and, um, and look out for maybe a few of the others because fantastic. Absolutely great. So... Um, He's, well, he doesn't have anything good. He's got some over there he can cheers with. You want to do one more cheers before yeah, we go? Yeah, I got some more over here. All right. Cheers you to know, Booker's. So he's and not driving, so, you know. I'm going to sit in my drinking. chair. I'm going to yeah. sit in my chair and drink whiskey the rest of the day and watch cheers. football. Cheers. We're watch some football. Cheer for your favorite team. Here's the Barrel House. Here's to the Barrel House. And uh, you guys have a great night. We will see you soon. The dogs are saying goodbye, too.